right, here's part one of my paper V8 engine project. And uh, so I've got the pistons and the crank housing put together and drying right now. Um, so as of now, the crank housing is drying. Um, in the back here, I've got all eight pistons, or not pistons, cylinders. And these are going to be the eight cylinders that go into the V8 engine. So they are all numbered. And they've got that hole in there and in there so the air goes through. And here's the pistons with the numbers. Now it's still drying, so got some glue on the sides. Here's the bottom. You can see the crank. I do have a little bit of problems with those, uh, the little toothpick pieces for the uh, actual cranks. Um, those little crank axles, some of them are a little too wide, like that one. They're kind of protruding a little bit, so um, I might have to make them a little smaller. But it's turning out really well. You can see the partitions. They were very, very... They, I had to be really careful with those to put them together. So there's the little cranks. There's a lot of little pieces of paper in this. And yeah, so we'll probably get the uh, all the cylinders mounted on in the next video. But the cylinders will be mounted like right here. So the pistons will slide in with the corresponding number. And they will be like that. And the reason why I put numbers on them instead of just randomly putting the pistons on is because, of course, when you make something with paper, they're like, no piston is the same. So some of them are a tiny bit wider, some of them have little sharp edges on them that like make that like don't really move up and down well or slide up and down well in some of the cylinders. So I had to adjust them and find the cylinder that they would fit perfectly in. And yeah, so, you know, after I've get, gotten more of this engine finished, I'll see you in the next video. Eventually, we'll have a final test of this.